Hey guys, it's uh, John with Indian Outdoors, and then I'm out here today doing a little firebird. As you can see, we already did um, another bird over here on this um, rye field. And this is kind of the perimeter um, of the sorghum that I planted last year. You can see, you know, as it goes behind me or what have you, um, I have a uh, fire break on either side, and a pretty good one because you know flames get high. It's a little dry. I mean, there's nothing but field that way, and it's all pretty green at this point, but. You know, we just want to play it safe and uh, and uh, do the best that we can, the safest that we can. Now, I'm not an expert on this, but uh, I have done several burns and uh, feel pretty confident in what I'm doing. Now, I'd probably need a little bit of help if I was doing a larger field, like the one. Well, this is the uh, behind me here is the um, what I planted here last year, the turnips and oats field I had last year. Had a lot of deer in there. Um, too bad the neighbor shot most of them coming to my food plot but that's another story but anyway uh we burnt that field last year before we planted the oats and all that stuff took really well so but we're just burning this strip of sorghum which i will not plant again because it was a pain in the you know what to take care of easy to plant um pain in the butt to get rid of you know the stalks are still here i chopped them down with a bush hog and uh <clears throat> try to let them dry out they're about as dry as they're gonna get and uh, so I did a burn on today. Probably go around and maybe pick some of them up after all the burn's done or just try to chop them up. I don't I don't know. We're gonna kinda wait and see and play that by ear. But anyway, just wanted to post on uh, the old YouTube page and uh, show you guys the burn that we're doing all the way down. It's only about um, 600 foot long, um, this sorghum was. So uh, just nice, gentle back burn into the wind. We don't want it to be a raging fire or anything like that. So. Anyway, it's John with Indian Outdoorsman.